Dallas checking out a property we actually have under contract. So we're just gonna do a walkthrough really quickly to show you what we're planning on doing with this property. So what you're looking at right here is a carport. Um, and there are a few houses in this area that actually don't have a garage. And um, some people are calling it like a California mid-century style. So you've got your carport here. This one has a planter box. Um, and then you've got this storage space at the end of the driveway. So that's semi-typical of this area. There's only a few like that, but there's a variation of styles basically throughout the whole neighborhood. So let's go inside. All right, so when you immediately walk in, you're gonna notice this brick wall that actually doesn't go all the way to the ceiling. So what we're gonna do is to open up this space, um, we'll probably just get rid of this brick and open up this area into the living room. So you've got your dining, um, and then this will be kind of like a peninsula. And currently, the washer and dryer are in the kitchen but we're actually gonna build out a closet for a stackable unit to uh, create more space because this property is only 1,100 square feet. So you've gotta you know, get space where you can. Another feature of this house is uh, under this carpet are the original hardwood floors. So we're gonna lift this carpet up. Hopefully, fingers crossed, the floors are in good shape <laughs> and we can just refinish them and then that will be that will be a huge bonus for this house. This is a three bedroom, one bath, and that's also very typical. So we're not even gonna add a bathroom on this one. Um, the comp only has one bath. Um, you'll notice in the corner, there's some stress cracks, pretty significant. Um, this house actually needs uh, quite a few piers to correct that. So you've got uh, three bedrooms, so there isn't really a true master. Um, one of the bedrooms could be considered a master because it has two closets. Um, otherwise, there is no ensuite. Um, systems actually look like they're in pretty good shape. So we may not have to worry about that, which is great. All right, let's go check out the backyard. got this nice barn storage unit back here which is which is great we're gonna put in a six foot privacy fence just to give it a little bit more privacy and to update it obviously um, we'll be painting the brick replacing the windows it's gonna get a new roof and we'll probably put in um, some pressure treated or cedar rails for this for these steps back here because as you can see these rails are pretty short, so this wouldn't pass code. So that's about it, and uh, we'll see you on the next one.